I really wish that this game would stop seeming like it's trying to judge me for stepping away from the game for like five minutes. Just so as I can get back some of my sanity. You don't need to try to jump scare me just because there's no connection for the Wiimote. Just say. Hello again folks and welcome back to Let's Play Fatal Frame. Uh, Mask of the Lunar Eclipse. I'm your game mysterious. Last we left off. We were unable to go that way because of a wheelchair. And, uh, the place is haunted. Go figure. Kind of hoping I can at least finish this chapter, this recording session. Yeah, now we're on the third floor. Uh, surely nothing could go wrong. I probably only need to investigate all the rooms here. Chapter done. Sure. Legit thought that there was going to be more to that chapter now that we had literally just got... Well, okay. We explored the outside, the break... Um, the basement, where it also led to the ritual chamber which I assume is going to be full of terrible things. And we eventually got to the third floor, so I thought no, that was a pretty hefty chapter. Uh, let's see what we got to save. Uh, load. Red. Yes. What, what do we have for photos, anyways? Um... Ah yes, the lovely ladies from outside. Cute nurse. You know what? Cute nurse deserves to be saved. Sorry, guy that was down in the basement. That was pretty much it. Uh, wait, no. And save, load, ex oh right, Z button. Keep on forgetting that that's a thing. Yep, having some uh, good times. Oh wait, we can enlarge. Enhance. Protect. <laughs> Must protect, nurse. Okay, enough fooling around with the albums. It kind of does suck that it only saves the last 12 that you've taken. I don't know. Well, it would have been nice to be able to check out some of the other ones we had taken earlier, besides just the latest 12. Ah. Uh, while searching, Gorogetsu Hall, Misaki meets a girl in black clothes, whom she has met before in dreams. Come back to Gorogetsu Island. Misaki knows, wants to know more about her connection to this girl, led by the girl's images. Masaki arrives at a room. Ten years ago, this was Madoka's hospital room. She knew all the girls involved that were kidnapped, who were hospitalized in the institute, or visited it regularly. They came to the treat be treated for an endemic disease, the Lunar Sedata Syndrome. Caught up in memories, she does not notice that she's been separated from Madoka. Madoka? Where's Madoka? Madoka. <laughs> The masked pale. I have to find Madoka. 
I'm glad you suddenly realize that now, as we are on to a new chapter. Blue crystal. Okay, don't know if you just don't like that, but uh... Bloodstained Diary. Great. That nurse came again today to tell me I was too noisy. When I made a little cut and pulled the scissors back, she gave an ugly howl. I hid her ugly insides. Things I like are much prettier. Crushed insects, torn hands, wet red flesh, the loud scream before the ghost skidil. These pretty things will soon dis will disappear soon. Everyone else collects things that they think are pretty. The doctor told me that collecting things I like helps my illness. So I collect these pretty things, collecting more and more, unless I collect these things the inside of me. The letters after this are too messy to read. So was Aiko transferred to the fourth floor or something? Oh good. <laughs> Oh good. We are now stuck here. Now is something over there? Did Did we not notice okay. We I did not notice Hello? I did not notice the door before. Obviously. Right, this was the room with the canopy bed. Thanks, I hate it. No saw canopy bed. Red strings are wound around the square posts. Doesn't appear to be anyone inside. I don't want to grab this. Some kind of note is written on a torn piece of paper. What happened? Who is that guy outside? His face was all messed up. Help me, you. So so noisy outside. The face looks like a cracked egg, like a smashed butterfly, like an open stomach. Such a messed up face. After looking at that face inside my head, it got so noisy. Until I get all messed up. I'll wait here. Wait. 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 Mother. I heard another thing being revealed. Oh, I did. Cool. Yeah. Ah. Oh, I know where that is. I think he even commentated on freaking creepy ass doll. That was weird. It seemed like my character was moving around something for a second. I hate it here. I hate it here. Gotta take a picture of a creepy doll. Oh, not even a picture. I just gotta... This is a doll in the picture. Rusty the key has been placed on the doll's lap. Yep. Kind of assumed. Now to be hunted by something in the bedroom, right? I wonder why my Wemo turned off. Like, batteries... Batteries in this sucker don't drain that quickly. Of course, then again, I haven't recharged it in a while, so... Yep. Hello, child. Go away, child. 
No one likes you. Little psychopath. Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> oh good, into a room with another bed. Have I been in this one? Oh, it's a film reel. Box? Something large is underneath the swaths of clothes. I mean, that's great, but film. Picked up the projector. Film. It's a photo of many people staring at a screen. It's probably a projector in the dining room. There's a single note attached to the projector film. I'll get to Kagura Video Archive. I've seen a few extracts compiled of the film. If we are not careful, someone will probably notice, and if this gets out, there will be trouble. Aoko took it and seems to find it amusing, but make arrangements to discard it when she becomes tired of it. Uh, declare of dust. Do I want to know what's underneath this bed? I'm concerned about this goddamn blue light pointing in this direction. I kind of want to assume that it's pointing at this box. Freedom! Yeah, I knew that door was going to open at some point. Alright. I'm assuming that the game wants me to... look at the film. Which means going to the dining hall. I'm just going to save beforehand so I don't have to do that little tussle with Aoko again. Being brave. Do I want to see whether or not she'll go down the elevator? Hello. Yep, don't like that muttering. Don't like that at all. All right. Hi. Yep. Didn't like that either. Mm-hmm. A lot of no thank you going on around here. You can play films with this. Oh, 
Sorry, buddy. Uh, I have to put you down. Oh, God, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where is it? Where's it going? God, that is such a quick approach. Stop that, Madoka. Damn it. I thought I hit that second one. Shit. What the shit? What the shit? We just left something behind. <sighs> okay, picked up the memo. I wonder if you met that child. As a child, that special person you always spoke of. Even though I felt that I may only have been a replacement, a toy for that person, I was happy when I was in your house instead of her. I was scared that you would remember her. I was always scared, but if you would only ever see me, if you would forget, then I would be happy. I'll return to my room now. I will always, I will also return to your room and return to that child. Oh, you will also return to your room and return to that child. It's okay to remember now. It's okay. It's okay. If we die together. Mm-hmm. I think I gotta go back to Misaki's room, right? That's what it's telling me to do. <gasps> you bastard. And now the item's gone. I held A for too long. I think that's what happened. Well, here. Collect. I collect. Ah, uh, shit. Which one was Masaki's room again? Let's see. List. Madoka. Kazuto. Management? Or do I gotta go to Madoka's room now? Kind of assuming it's Madoka's room now. See now she's returned to her room. Don't want to do, don't want to do the whole dying together thing, or the dying at all thing. Be great if we didn't die at all. <laughs> Thank you. I feel cheated out of that first one. <sighs> no. Yes, leave. Pressing B in order to say no is a little bit daunting of that one. Wait, does it want me to go to the third floor? Because that's the only way we're going to get to the third floor. What's on the third floor? I get a... Oh, Misaki's room. We've not been to Misaki's room yet. So if she was on the third floor, that means that Misaki was a more advanced case. Of Luna Sedata. I wonder if she got. Because I'm assuming that just seeing the blooming causes the effect of Luna Sedata in people. 
At least that's what that one note seems to be entailing. Hello. At least that's that that's what that one note was telling me. Which makes sense. Sorta. Good thing all this stuff is unlocked now. Are these two rooms connected? Misaki's and uh, Ruka's? Ruka... If, that, if that's the case, Misaki seems to have access to... What I'm kind of assuming to be a balcony of some sort. That was Ruka's room. Which one was this one? That's the gallery. That's the Yuko. Let's go to Misaki's. Locked. Oh. I think I just used the bigger, better, better. Nope. Hmm. There's be a red wheelchair left in the room somewhere. I'm familiar with this wheelchair. I'm familiar with this wheelchair. I'm gonna have to check out the wheelchair. And because there's a thing about a bad omen about messing with wheelchairs, Saki's gonna get cursed. Wait, is the wheelchair gone? Hmm. Gonna save. Cause that's where the wheelchair was. Oh no, that was with Ruka. Where could it have gone now? Well, I got an entire goddamn ward up to Kagetis. I was kind of hoping that was locked as well. <laughs> uh, great. Spooky, scary hallways. Gonna rip out my soul. Oh, like a little... Little hammer. Like one of those break glass in case of emergency hammers, but missing the whole glass part. An important piece of paper? No? I was checking my map just to see if there's any other doors. Got a bad feeling about this. Especially seeing as they're giving me 61 type film. Don't like that. Don't like that. Uh. 
Kamisari Zuki room. That was the name of my room. And now I gotta run all the way back to there. This is a very weird room. Is this a coffin? A woman with a red ornament in her black hair it's on this distorted gray background. Holding a bouquet of red flowers in her hand. The girl is depicted with a bouquet of flowers on a distorted gray background. Eyes are black and her face is twisted in an agonizing yell. Yeah, no. Pretty good description. Like a profile of a skull. You know, I think we're done here. We are done here, right, game? We're not done here. Ah. Hello. How's it going? Can I leave now? I'd like to leave, please. Hack me, and you'll see, I might die in this world of terrible horror. I hate you. This is in fact a coffin. Hate it here. Surface of American skin is cracked. Is she looking out at me? I'd like to leave, please. Uh, boy. Do I gotta be standing in just the right position for this? I gotta, get, gotta be standing in just the right position for this or something. It is in fact a coffin. Like, I gotta loot the room? Oh good, there is more to this room. What is wrong with the indiv individuals within this place? The letter was hidden inside the coffin. I was born dead. You were not. Even though we had the same blood flowing through us, you were alive. So you lived to die. If you could truly live while dying, the two of us could return to our small room. If it is possible to die without death, without death, like two halves of a closed shell, like the am amaryllis flower, without death continuing to bloom for eternity. You are me, you are me, now you became me. I'm here, where I'll go on blooming. I don't want any of these coffins to be full. Why are they all empty? I think the better question is, oh, good, they're all empty. It's not even a question, that's just a statement. Keep talking, please. I'm not sure if I have forever, but any words are good, even if they hurt. How can I make you happy if you are lonely? I'm dying while still alive. Please tell me that you will try to make friends. Anybody will do. Will you go and search for someone today? Like that girl who peeked into this room. Don't destroy her. I'm a little bit concerned about that phrasing. Don't destroy her. 
God, this is a heavy aspirin. Physics. Oh, hi. You're awake. Ah. Thanks for that camera. I think that's it. the ante of my camera shelling. Oh, hello. Boo. The fact that I was able to do that rather effectively is nice. Oh, good. Of course, there's something within the coffin. If you can just forgive me, then we can. When I pushed you over, it was on purpose. I pushed you over the edge, but I, but it will all, but I be forgiven. Because of me, you went into the darkness. I must accept that the darkness inside you will not leave. I understand that wherever I hide, you will continue to look for me. No matter where, wherever I escape to, you will never give up. So the only way is to pray that the light shines into your darkness. Can I now leave? Can I leave, please? I'd like to leave, please, now. Ugh. By the way, fun reminder. Uh, and I, I was telling my buddy Link about this the other day, too. Uh, is that this is from uh, Grasshopper Studios, or Grasshopper Manufacturer. You know, the same people behind No More Heroes, Killer7. I've honestly not played those myself, but they are definitely surreal, to say the least. So, having all these rooms being very, very different per patient is uh, definitely a thing. So, I would save and call an episode here, but I just want to save, because I want to see what happens when we go to Misaki's room. I'm too curious at this point. I'm also going to need to get new batteries for... Either new batteries or find my charger thing for my Wiimote. So just a smidgen longer episode, I think. Now that'll stop me now. Right game. Nothing to stop me now. Don't stop me now. I'm having such a good time. I'm having a ball, yeah. Why am I doing this? Could have called it an episode. Theoretically, there shouldn't be anything terrible for Misaki in this room. It's Misaki's room, you know? Nothing terrible whatsoever. Don't like the fact that you, had, you got yourself a little baby bed there. Where'd that fall? Better question, where'd that fall from? Oh, hi. Old research. What looks like a research document was placed here. Many of the inventors are based on the theory... Inventions are based on the theory that special a benefit to be handled that requires attention. Here, usefulness was concluded in the treatment written down. The Spirit Stone flashlight returns the memories of patients of Lunar Sedata Syndrome. Moonlight made collecting the moonlight. Lost memories are recalled by its light. I'm assuming that a bunch of the spaces are just missing words within the text itself. 
The treatment forced blooming and its effect. The spirit stone radio, using a crystal can, a special frequency called residual thoughts, namely hearing the requests of the dead confirmed. However, it is strongly thought chagrin and voice resentment here a person's mind and body eats away at caution required. Spirits are visible with the camera obscura and the machine, the something, was handled with spiritual intuition, advantageous possession, the rest is rotten away and is impossible to read. Broken crystal radio. Seems to be old children's clothing in the cabinet drawer. Probably still don't fit her or anything. Reach out, get scared. Hack power lens. We learn a little bit about the crystal flashlight. Oh! A set of panels plant, uh, painted with patterned carp. A panel it seems to be missing. Sakia Soul medical chart. The Sakia Soul, age 7, room 310. Seem, it's questionable whether a patient has budded or not. Her memory impairment is becoming comparatively, considerably worse. Her self-recognition is becoming more vague, and when she sees herself in the mirror, she is terrified. As soon as the characteristic symptoms of advanced Luna Sedata become obvious, she'll be diagnosed with Luna Sedata Syndrome. The disease is rapidly progressing and it is becoming severe. In this patient's case, it is clear that the progression of the Luna Sedata is related to the psychic disposition of the patient in room 412, Yogetsu. It is extremely difficult to cure female patients in whom the onset occurs during between the ages of uh, before the ages of 10 to 12. It appears very likely that living conditions will have a strong impact on her psycholog psychologically. Everyone should thoroughly observe her condition and record it in detail. Special notes, an experimental schedule of treatment for the patient in 412 has been decided. The treatment of the patient in 412 may potentially lead to a clue in curing this disease. Additional note, she has a strong attachment to Mia, who tends to stabilize her condition so we request that they not be separated unreasonably. Doctors. Oh god damn it. Wasted the film. Oh. Where are you? No. Go away. Heck. Oh, don't tell me that didn't count. Oh no, it did. How many ghosts are in this room with me? Come on. Stop that. Oh, don't tell me that I keep on missing because of the goddamn... 
Hate that thing. Note to self, never have room dividers. Oh. No, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, hi. Dirty pool appearing behind me. You son of a bitch. Come on, where are you? Good lord. Persistent doctors even in death. What do we have here? Oh, the koi panel. Totally fine. Uh, carpet painted on the crafted wooden panel. It seems as if the pictures are connected, it will open. Oh. <laughs> okay, it's a rotation one, not a sliding one. That makes it significantly easier, I think. I'm not saying easy peasy, but easier. Oh boy. There. No, there's a white one there, so that one. And that. That makes no sense. That does. I like that puzzle. I I want I want more puzzle box things like that. Small key put away inside. Flat zinc key. This is a photo of me. I'd say that was well worth it. We're gonna go ahead and call an episode here. When we return, I guess we're going to go to another chapter. Don't know who. I don't know who the pretty lady on the bed was. I don't know if it's necessarily the same lady that was in the picture. Because goddamn game loves covering the faces of people. <laughs> that made no sense. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. When we return, new chapter. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.